Hello, in this video we are going to take a look of how you can add an accordion to your uh, card website. This can be done totally for free and uh, it will be easy to do. So I have here for instance an example with a card with an accordion that you can add. You see in here this is the accordion you can add as many tabs as you as you like and it has an uh, activation change color. You can modify the colors as you as you like. So this is also responsive. If you see in here that right now it's looking also nice on mobile. And uh, you can customize this for instance like this. This is the team that I am having and uh, I've modified it to be different. So you see that you can customize this in the way you, you like. You can change any, any color you, you want and font size if uh, you want. So I have here the card uh, me website where I have the plugin added, it's free to download and, and use. And we are going to go to the whole process that you need to do and uh, have this plugin added. So you need to have the embed functionality because this is having a shortcode that you are going to need to add and modify it as accordingly. So you see in here that you have a download button. By the way, in here you have other free plugins if you want tutorials at the end with some cards three teams and yeah things things like this so visit card me if you want to to find out more about card so let's go and download this so what you do is go to download this will redirect download page you see in here that it's free to to download if you want so you need to input your uh, email address I always the one and your name in here and hit purchase with zero and after you should receive an email with the download details. Okay. So right now you are also redirected to your uh, dashboard page, customer dashboard. You can set a password if you want for your account. And you here you have the download. And let's go and download this. So let's go and hit the download. I will put it in my user directly. So you see that right now there is a zip that was downloaded with this. Let's go and prepare the the grounds from for this team. So in here I go to edit. So in here I have the the, the team. If we're gonna check it, it doesn't have anything added. So yeah, right now we have this team that uh, we want to to modify and add an uh, accordion in in here, and we are gonna go and do just just that and here you see also that the email was sent with the with the download if you want if you're not redirecting for some reason you have the options to download it in here so we're going here and the download and the app add it to add it we just need to to go and uh, right now we're on the team and i want to add it before the contact us in here and what i will going to do is to go on to the download area i will just show in Pinder and you see in here that we have the zip I will just open it because it will unzip it you see in here that we have a file with card accordion and this one I will just edit it in, um, in an editor so I have a visual studio code in here I will open it with this because it's looking more nice and in here I have some plugins that will show you the colors. So this is the actual file that you are going to get. So in here you have the the styles and the, you can change the colors if you want in, in here for the for the, for the panels. And so you can change the, the tabs. So for instance, if you want this tab to be called, uh, let's say how you purchase, for instance, how you buy. I'll just put it something like that and in here for instance uh, shipping you can even add a new a new one if you want or you can delete and for instance if you want to add a new one you just copy this from the bottom button to with the text and just add it at the end and or wherever you want and in here for instance you can change the, the name I will just add a new tab in here and your tab like this, just for you to see. 
And in here, you can modify the text of that tab. So for instance, for the buy now, how you buy. So you can buy with your credit card, for instance. And you can put whatever you want in here. This is just plain HTML. And in here, you can change the colors. I will just add this so you see how it's looking right now. And afterward, we can go and customize some of the colors that uh, that we have for this to make some small modifications. So I will copy all of this. I will go to the my website editor and let's see. So for instance, I want to add it before here. So I will select that and I will add a container. So right now I have a container. I don't want to have a background with blue like this. So I will go and change the background because this is just copy the style. So let me change to none. So right now I have an empty container in here. And what I need to do is to go and add an um, embed form. So you need the pro plan for this. So in here, you see that you have the embed in here and you have the code that you need to choose. You can label it like uh, and style it in line. And in here, you just paste the code that you, uh, that you download it with the modifications. And then you hit done. And right now we just need to save this for this to be able to be activated. Okay, let's wait for this to publish and then we are gonna check it. So if we're gonna hit your demo, we should see in here an um, accordion with the tabs that we we added. So we see in here that you have the tab name in, in this and in here you have the, the text that we just added. If we're gonna go and check on mobile, you will gonna see that this is looking also nice on, on mobile. You see, don't have any problems. We need the text is looking nice. Okay. So right now, for instance, let's say we want to change the top colors and the active colors for the, for the tab. We can do that without any problems. So to do that, we just need to go and open the file that we just downloaded. I will order Visual Studio Code. And in here you have the accordion color. So I've put it in here, some comments, so you can see what is the text. So let's say we want to make a blue. Let's put it like this. In here, it, the text color, it's white because the white is looking good with blue. In here, um, we have the, for the, we have the options to change the color for the, for the plus. If we want, let's go and put it, for instance, a green one, a green color like this for the, for the plus. In here, we have the background color and the color for the close button. I will just let it like this. In here is the accordion uh, hover when you go and uh, put your mouse on it. But this is the panel background. So I will uh, let all of these things uh, right now like uh, like this and see how it's looking. And afterwards, we can go and uh, modify them if we'd like to change some, some more things. So what we need to do is just go and uh, modify the text modify the code in here. So I will just delete and paste again. Right now, let's save it because you cannot see it. Otherwise, with this embed code, see a demo. So you see right now that the top color changed. I had the, for the hover, the default color on the activated color. So I like it. If you see in here that the activation change to, to the green and yeah, now it's looking uh, more nice and more with the colors that I have on, on this team. You can add, for instance, a header in here. If you, if you want, this can be done with the controls that, that you have. So for instance, you just go and add the text in here and move it. So in here you can put uh, 
the text copy it. let's go and edit the text because right now it's in blue let's go and change the size how it's looking so here you see that you have the nice header in here and here you have the accordion with the details so yeah like this you can edit also you can make another adjustments if you want the um, you don't need to be an expert in this because everything is commented in here and you can just add or modify that easily with any text editor that you want i prefer this one because it has some plugins that uh, it uh, shows you the colors and it formats the css and html and like this so I have also other tutorials uh, on my channel for card, for instance, how you can create a sticky header, like you see in that team, or you can add a cookie banner and things like that. In case you enjoy what you are seeing, please uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions related to card, you can drop a link into the video comment. Thanks for watching and uh, see you next time.